example of uh, input tax credit you have to know certain rules of availability of input tax credit if the supply is taxable including the zero rated the input tax credit is available taxable supply input tax credit is available zero rated taxes input tax credit is available for the exempted supply or non taxable supply of goods or services the input tax credit is not available while calculating the problem you have to analyze whether the supplied goods is taxable or not it is taxable then only the input tax credit is available if zero rated then also tax is available but not on exempted supply not on taxable value of supply let's come with some examples a manufacturer has entered into a contract of supply of machine the price of the machine is given machine inspection it is additional charges by the supplier supplying the machine right packing charges applicable transportation cost for dispatch of finished machine there is also additional charges design and drawings given here the price of machine are included it is included in price of the machine that is 450000 it includes the designing and drawings and the gst applicable rate is 12% now come to another information some of find the taxable value and gst payable after adding this you will get the taxable value and apply the gst rate at 12% you get the gst payable now the manufacturer used capital goods look at this the manufacturer using the manufacturer using the capital goods means using as an input while manufacturing a machine what he used capital goods some of the equipments he used it for manufacturing the machine which includes 15000 of gst 15000 of the gst is an input and some of the input has uh, consist of the 8500 rupees to the supplier the supplier using input 15000 and 8500 it is an our input and this input is eligible for credit now first we have to ascertain the our tax liability price of the machine taken inspection packing transportation we not taken designing and drawings we not taken the designing and drawings because it is included now you ascertain the by adding this taxable value of supply and apply the gst that is applicable rate is 12% so 12% on taxable turnover or value of supply you will get the invoice or price or bill value the 59488 is a gst liability that is a output tax liability which we supplied the goods now why we need the output tax liability and input for ascertaining the net gst payable net gst formula output tax liability minus input tax credit so output tax liability we get this 59448 and the input tax credit the input used is 15000 as capital 8500 as other inputs now compute output tax liability we already known and the input as capital and as input we add and deduct it from 59 output minus input you will get the net gst payable as per the formula okay. now move on to the second one another example vijaya limited situated in bangalore has presented the following information purchase of raw material now look at this they given the purchase not supply purchase means it is an input used in manufacturing so it is a purchase of raw material within the state some of the purchase information consultation for how to purchase and what and how the marketing strategy and the storage cost it is also used as an input cost 
ट्रांसपोर्टेशन इनपुट इनपुट कॉस्ट लेबर कॉस्ट दैट इज आल्सो एन इनपुट नाउ द जीएसटी इज ऑन सप्लाई द गिवन द इंफॉर्मेशन अबाउट इनपुट नाउ लुक एट दिस द गुड्स सोल्ड फॉर रुपीज फाइव लैख ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड इट इज एन आउटपुट दैट इज द सप्लाई द सेल्स डायरेक्टली गिवन इन अ प्रॉब्लम द दे आस्क अबाउट द नेट जी एस टी नेट जी एस टी मीन्स आउटपुट माइनस इनपुट टैक्स क्रेडिट नाउ अज्यूम दैट सी जी एस टी रेट फाइव एंड एस जी एस टी रेट ऑफ टैक्स इज फाइव परसेंट कम टू कैलकुलेशन कॉम्पिटेशन ऑफ टैक्सेबल वैल्यू एंड जी एस टी पेपर दैट इज नेट जी एस टी सेल्स इज गिवन फाइव लैख ट्वेंटी डायरेक्टली टेकन द फाइव परसेंट एंड द फाइव परसेंट एस जी एस टी एंड सी जी एस टी ना वी ना वी नीड टू नो द इनपुट टैक्स क्रेडिट द आउटपुट इज सप्लाई which is we already determined now input tax credit <laughs> calculation of the input used in the transaction course purchase of raw material consultation storage transportation cost of labor add it from the above all are used as input in the manufacturing process so take as all input total is 4 lakh 62500 we already ascertain the cgst sgst on output look at this take this calculation in the table that is output on sales used as an input that is this total of total cost apply the gst rate and you will get output minus input and you will get the net GST. Okay, this is simple problems. Thank you.